it's nighttime and somebody is not getting sleepy. He wants to keep playing. Um, question one. Biggest fear while traveling. Jasmine said her biggest fear was breaking down. I'm going to say, I don't know that I have any fears, but I'm going to, I'm going to go with getting into an accident. Um, something like hitting a deer or, or some drunk it coming, uh, in the opposite lane, veering off course and smacking into me or something. I'm going to go with an accident as opposed to breaking down. Last time I did a puzzle. Jeez, that's been a very long time. I bought some puzzles for my mom when she got dementia because it was supposed to be a good thing for them to do for people with Alzheimer's dementia. And she didn't look at them. She didn't open the box. Um, now, I do games on my phone. I do uh, Words with Friends, which is sort of um, Scrabble, kind of. And I do um, the two games that are popular through Facebook apps. Is it Facebook apps? Or is it just an app? I don't know. Wordle and Connections. Uh, I do those three games pretty much every day. Um, as a kid, oh, did you make your own go-kart is the next question. No, I don't think I made a go No, I know I'd never made a go-kart. We had uh, pedal cars and uh, bikes that were bought, but we didn't make our own go-kart. Um, the closest thing I could think of to that would be Pinewood Derby in Cub Scouts, where you would make a little race. You, you got a block of wood, and you had to carve a race car out of it. And it had um, plastic wheels and axles, and you just had to construct a race car. And then there was a race. And I got third place once um, at a trophy for one of those. But that would be the closest to a go-kart, making something like that. But that you you don't sit in that. It, it's just a little model. It's just like, I don't know. How, how would it have been? Um, were they like six to eight inches long, I think? So that would be the closest to that. Are you as adventurous as you were years ago? I think so. Um... Maybe even more so because I have more time to explore and do things. Um, so I might be even more adventurous now that I have more freedom. The last question is, what do you need help with the most? Hmm. That's, I can't think of much that I need help with. I don't know. I'm a pretty independent, self-contained person. The only thing I can think of are um, when I have a snake <laughs> in the yard or my garden. Um, I usually ask for assistance for that because I cannot stand them. Um, I have a visceral dislike of snakes, so it's very hard for me to have one around. Um, and I find it very hard to, oh man, I mean, to even think of it, <laughs> to even think of attempting to catch one in a box to get rid of it or pick it up or anything that just makes me go, go cold. So if there's something that I would need help with, it would be dealing with the snake. That's the only thing I can think of. Okay. I'm all caught up now, I believe.